yes guys i am so excited to bring you this news i am very very happy if you're willing to migrate if you're willing to travel for free guys if you're willing to migrate this video is for you please keep on watching <laughs> guys you're welcome to my channel if today's your first time please don't forget to hit the like button don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to also put on the notification bell and so you get notified each time i post a video this is life of sabelle my name is sabelle where i bring you contents from migration where i bring you contents from motherhood where i bring you also my lifestyle journey in on my journey in the uk so today i'll be sharing with you guys a company that is offering a tier two sponsorship from anywhere in the world for those that want to migrate to the uk and guys i want you all to take advantage of this opportunity because it will be ending in january also please watch till the end of the video because i will be showing you how you need to apply for this rule i'll be showing you the entire process of how you should apply for this rule guys so the company recruiting is aviana healthcare and they are recruiting from eight different locations guys eight different locations so this is the description and like i said the closing date is first of january 2023 so this is the company description the company provides care to different individuals in their own home and this is their key values opportunity to develop they'll give you fairness there will be uh, equality of opportunity uncompromising professionalism that is what you will get from the company also they also have their values and cultures as you can see on the screen they do not compromise their high standards guys and they have they give you the opportunity to choose they also value integrity and they listen to their clients as well as their staff and guys this is the job description community carer so they have about eight different locations eight different location guys this is for a community carer more or less like a domiciliary care worker and it is for 39 hours per week and if you also want overtime the company will give you as well and the salary is twenty thousand pounds twenty thousand 500 pounds to 22,000 pounds and it is a permanent contract so it is very good and they said as a community clearer carer you have a flexible work life so it is not a very strict rule it's something that you can manage and guys this is what you'll be doing you'll be providing companionship assisting with personal care and medication assisting with meal preparation and household chores and this is the purpose and guys this is what they can offer you excellent rate of pay paid mileage you'll be having bank holidays um paid ongoing training and development access to comprehensive online learning platform guys so so many advantages to work for this company free dbs free uniform and they say the application is for both applicants that reside in the uk and have the right to work and international applicants so this is it guys aviana healthcare is an approved uk tier 2 visa sponsorship employer so you click on apply now and it will take you to the next page and here is showing you that the aviana company they sponsor for tier 2 so you have to meet all the requirements to be able to you have to meet all the requirements in order for them to consider you so they say we receive a high number of applicants every day so to be considered you must meet all the requirements guys so yeah 
you can start filling the application form by putting your name and everything marked in red must be filled and after your name you select the position you are applying for the date of completing the form and then you click on next if you want to save and come back later you can do that as well and then you move on you put your address and then you also put your number your telephone number guys they said for the national insurance number leave blank if applying from outside the uk and you can also include your date of birth and then you move forward you put your email do you require a visa you respond do you have a full do you require a visa under the sponsorship program do you hold a full international clean driving license valid in the uk so you also respond if you do if yes upload a copy do you have a current police clearance if you do upload a copy and so you click on next or come back later you also fill in your employment details your name of employer address and what you were doing before that's the post title as well as the date and give a brief description of your duties and then you also um, put save or you come back later and then this is another employment details here you also fill your employers and all the position you held and your duties also make sure that you fill them up properly it's a reason for leaving name of employer so you have to fill all the employers that you have worked for in the last 10 years in this part and then and then you continue by clicking next or you save and come back later and then this is the educational qualification part you also fill it and this is the professional qualification part you also fill it as well if you also have any professional tech tech and technical association you include it and now this is any training that you have have done in the past you include the title of the training program or the course and then you click on next if you haven't you can leave it and then this is a personal statement and if you've been involved in any voluntary work or any unpaid activities you include it here your skills your knowledge your experience you include it how do you meet the employer's requirements include it then this is for conventions that are unspent if you've done any offense you give details and the sentence and then also this one is for dbs disclosure and barring service you click on it and this is this is also the disability section it, and uh, do you have a disability relevant to the application you give details and then do they need to make any arrangements for you for the interview you give details a number of days sickness absence in the last two days you give details now this is also for the reference so here you'll be giving the name the position of the reference that you you want to give and it has to be two so you say please give the names and addresses of your two most recent employers if you're unable to do this clearly outline who your reference are and then this is what you fill in the work relationship the organization telephone number to reach this reference are you willing for this referee to be approached prior to the interview you click yes or no and then you also give details of the second reference that they need to contact and this is the detail for the person telephone number email and all that and guys are you willing also for this referee to be approached you also click on save or next and you come back later so they said this part is for equal opportunities policies to ensure that it is fully implemented it say application for the post of say healthcare assistant what is your ethnic group you choose gender male female or other disability do you consider yourself disabled you click on which one applicable to you your present status are you applying from outside the uk on the uk your age group as well then you click on next and 
or save and continue then say please take the days available for work you also click on it and here this is where you sign that the details that you have given is correct you put your name the your first and last name date and time as well and then that is it you stop so you submit if there are any errors it will let you know and so this is the end of the application if you're having any issues let me know in the comment section i will respond to you so guys we have come to the end of this video if you found it helpful please give me a thumbs up don't forget to like don't forget to subscribe don't forget to share to your family and friends and i'll see you guys in my next video bye bye guys